let's do a different style of bread today i'm going to show you how to do chocolate bread rolls or chocolate buns for this recipe i'm using 260 grams of bread flour with 10 grams bread improver when you work with chocolate sometimes the bread can be very dense if you don't add any bread improver 30 grams butter or coconut oil and 10 grams sugar, 5 grams salt, a teaspoon of instant dry yeast, 1 egg, 120 milliliters warm water with 2 tablespoons of cocoa powder. So let's start. First of all, I'm going to add the warm water into the mixing bowl. Into that, add the sugar and a teaspoon of yeast. So mix the yeast and the sugar well and leave it to throw about 10 minutes. As you can see, it has started activating. Now into that, going to add the flour, egg. If you are a vegetarian, you can always omit the egg from this recipe. And two tablespoons cocoa powder. If you like more darkness, you can always add a bit more cocoa powder, but the water level will be a bit higher. Now into that, going to add the bread improver. You can always buy the bread improver from the bread section of your supermarket and going to mix it on a low speed. Add the salt too. After mixing about two minutes, it will look like this. And into that, add the coconut oil or the butter. And mix this on a low speed about 10 minutes until it's really pliable and elastic. After kneading the dough about 10 minutes, it will look like this. It's a bit sticky. It's okay. So I'm going to take it out and leave it in the same bowl to double in size. Now the dough is ready. It's already doubled in size. So I'm going to press it down and take it onto the bench top. It's a bit sticky dough, so put a little bit more flour and press and cut the dough into equal size pieces. I'm going to cut it into six. Take each piece out, press and roll inwards. Like this. and put it in a tray like this. I'm using a 20 centimeter cake pan. I put the baking paper underneath. After, leave it again covered in a warm place to double in size. As you can see, the chocolate bread has risen a lot. Now this goes to the preheated oven, 180 Celsius, about 20 minutes or so until it's fully baked. I took the bread out from the oven just now. As you can see, it's really soft and moist bread. I'm going to transfer this onto a wire rack to cool down completely. And after that, I'll show you how it looks like. So the bread is ready and this is how it is. So let's open one and see how nice and soft it is. Very spongy and a very soft bread. So hope you will like this recipe. See you next time.